So there's this feminization in society of men. They want to label masculinity as something really, really bad. It is a war on men. And consequently, it's a war on women because we're married to men. We, we give birth to male children. And part of making sure our society continues is having two different genders. I mean, you can't not have genders. I'm sorry. I mean, they've been able to do a lot with science. Nobody's been able to grow, thank goodness, a baby in an artificial womb or put a, a uterus into a man and say, okay, you know, here, go for it, grow a baby. Now, that's something that's still pretty special just to us ladies. Thank you very much. But you need to think about this in context of what's going on with China right now, because they got tons of men and they got like uber masculinity there. Why? They don't have a lot of women as a result of their one child policy that was in place for so many years. And you've heard this horror stories. And, you know, I, I remember as a kid, families adopting these young girls from China because otherwise they, they wouldn't have made it. I mean, it's, it's horrible to talk about. And many, many young baby girls lost their lives. The thinking was that the boy would help take the family forward. So now they're left with all these men. And people have said that there is a danger China becomes extremely aggressive because you don't have any females or enough females to kind of temper. You're not going to have as many mothers and sisters and wives. So where does that society go? Well, simultaneously ours is, you know, jumping over the cliff with wigs and fake eyelashes and, and high heels. That's what the, our men are doing that. 